Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. If you enjoy learning about expedition yachts, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for more videos like this. Today, we're looking at the Arxen 85, a British built explorer yacht that's been making waves in the industry. At 89 feet, seven inches long, 27.3 meters, with a 23 foot beam, this aluminum vessel represents a different approach to expedition yacht design. The Arxen 85 is built by, wait for it, Arxen, a British company founded with a mission to create adventure capable yachts while supporting marine conservation. The company has positioned itself around sustainable exploration with a focus on reaching remote destinations responsibly. What sets this boat apart is its construction. The hull is crafted from a single piece of aluminum that contains 40% recycled content. This welded aluminum construction is designed for durability with minimal maintenance requirements, important for a yacht intended for serious expedition use. The naval architecture comes from Humphreys Yacht Design, a firm known for both high performance racing yachts and long range cruising vessels. The hull design prioritizes efficiency and stability with the goal of providing comfort across various sea conditions. For propulsion, the Arxen 85 offers two main options. The standard setup uses twin 350 horsepower diesel engines driving conventional propellers. However, there's also an optional hybrid system that includes three 268 horsepower diesel generators, lithium ion battery banks, and electric motors. This hybrid setup allows for silent running and can reduce emissions during certain operations. The range is where the shot really stands out. Arxen claims over 7,000 nautical miles at economical speeds, which would make it capable of crossing oceans with substantial fuel reserves. The fuel capacity is 18,000 liters, about 4,755 gallons, supporting this long range capability. The top speed is relatively modest at 14 knots, reflecting the boat's focus on efficiency rather than speed. This is typical of serious expedition yachts where range and fuel economy take priority over performance. Inside, the design team at Design Unlimited has used sustainable materials throughout. This includes recycled cotton yarns, cork walls, and reclaimed wooden panels. The approach balances environmental consciousness with luxury yacht expectations. The layout includes multiple guest cabins and what Arkins describes as well-equipped living spaces. There's a central dinette position where motion is minimal, making it more comfortable for dining in rough conditions. The galley features commercial grade equipment and a secure storage design to prevent items from moving around during rough passages. An interesting feature is the optional solar panel array, which can generate additional power and extend the yacht's ability to operate without running generators. This ties into Arxen's overall philosophy of sustainable operation. The company has also incorporated what they call sea time pledges, encouraging owners to make their vessels available for scientific research when not in personal use. This creates a network of research capable vessels that can access remote areas for marine conservation work. I really love this concept. Storage and equipment carrying capability are substantial, allowing for tenders, diving gear, and other adventure equipment. The deck layout is designed to handle larger tenders and support equipment for serious exploration activities. Safety features include redundant systems throughout and construction that's designed to handle extreme conditions. The aluminum construction provides strength while the hull offers stability in challenging seas. The Arxen 85 represents a particular philosophy in yacht design, prioritizing capability and environmental responsibility alongside luxury and comfort. At around 27 meters long, it sits in a size range that offers significant capability while remaining manageable for smaller crews. This isn't a yacht for those seeking maximum speed or traditional luxury styling. Instead, it appeals to owners who want to reach remote destinations while minimizing their environmental impact and potentially contributing to marine research and conservation efforts. 
The British construction and design also differentiate it from the more common Italian or Dutch expedition yachts, offering buyers an alternative approach to this market segment. What do you think about this approach to expedition yacht design? Would you prefer the hybrid propulsion system for its environmental benefits or stick with conventional diesels for simplicity? Let me know in the comments below. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to see more yacht reviews. Hit that notification bell so you never miss an upload. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.